गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट सो ऑल ऑफ यू नो दैट द कम्प्लीट वर्ल्ड इज फाइटिंग विद एपेडेमिक डिजीज कोरोना सो इन दिस लॉकडाउन कंडीशन द स्कूल इज नॉट रनिंग प्रॉपरली सो टैगोर ग्रुप ऑफ एजुकेशन डिसाइडेड टू स्टार्ट ऑनलाइन क्लासेज फ्रॉम टूडे आई एम अहमद वर्मा एंड आई एम जस्ट स्टडी द क्लास ट्वेल्थ बायोलॉजी सब्जेक्ट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू स्टडी सम बेसिक पॉइंट इन क्लास ट्वेल्थ बायोलॉजी देर आर प्रेजेंस ऑफ टोटल 42 चैप्टर आउट ऑफ 42 चैप्टर 20 चैप्टर बिलोंग्स टू बोटनी एंड 22 चैप्टर बिलोंग्स टू जूलॉजी सो डियर स्टूडेंट टुडे वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द जूलॉजी पोर्शन चैप्टर नंबर 22 एंड दैट इज डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम ऑफ ह्यूमन सो वी हैव टू स्टडी दैट सो फर्स्ट टॉपिक इन दिस चैप्टर इज अबाउट इंट्रोडक्शन it mean what we have to study in this chapter what is the meaning of digestion what is the meaning of digestive system how food digested inside the human body what is the complete procedure so first of all if i am asking you in the nature so many living organisms are survive every living organisms require energy for daily activity humans animals plants and for daily activity the human uptake food from the environment in small classes you have studied that in food particle basically three important biomolecules are present and these biomolecules are carbohydrate protein and fat so in our food carbo protein and fat are present basically all these three biomolecules are large in size complex in structure and these biomolecules are known as complex biomolecule so question is that when we uptake these biomolecules in our body these biomolecules starts to break down in the presence of digestive enzyme so in our body carbohydrate complex molecule breaks down into small unit that is known as monohydrate the protein break down into the small unit that is known as amino acid and fat or lipid that break down into two component that is fatty acid and glycerol now very important question what is the meaning of digestion when we have take these biomolecules in our body inside the cell these biomolecules digested break down into small biomolecules and energy is released this complete process is known as what digestion so what is the general process a biological process in which inside the human body the complex food material break down into simple food particle and energy is released this process is known as what digestion process and this complete system in our body that system is known as what digestive system so bachcho in this complete chapter we have to study the digestion process and the digestive system so now the next slide in this chapter the second topic is structure of human digestive system the first question is that in human body where food is digested inside the human body a long thick and muscular tube is present you have seen in the diagram this is the long thick muscular tube and that tube it is known as alimentary canal and inside this alimentary canal our food is digested so you have seen that in this diagram in alimentary canal lots of parts are present number 1 that is the mouth the anterior pore then inside the mouth a buccal cavity the space is present then just below the buccal cavity pharynx is present then esophagus then stomach then small intestine then large intestine and some presence of specific gland for example in buccal cavity salivary glands are present the liver largest digestive gland we will study further and one gland is pancreas so bachcho in the structure of digestive system two part is present one is alimentary canal and second is some digestive gland and we have to study one by one this is the complete guideline that we have to study so now the next slide so that already i told you this is the alimentary canal 
Now, very very important question for NEET, for AIMS, Board of Examination. What is the complete length of elementary canal inside the human body? So, what is the complete length? It is about 9 meter long. And that is the part of elementary canal, mouth, buccal cavity, pharynx, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine. I just told you in previous slide. Except elementary canal, digestive glands are present. For example, liver, pancreas and salivary gland. So, Bacho, that is the introduction. Now, the next slide. So, in this chapter, now we have to study all the parts regarding to our elementary canal. And first of all, we have to study the first part that is mouth part. So, mouth is the anterior pore of the elementary canal that is surrounded by the lips. And very basic is that mouth, it is used to uptake the food particle from the environment. And very very important, the complete process in which mouth uptake food particle, this process, it is known as what? Ingestion process. What is the name of the process? Ingestion. It is very important, a process in which mouth is used to uptake the food particle, this process is known as ingestion. So, bacho, that is the mouth. Now, inside the mouth, a space is present, a cavity is present and that cavity, it is known as what? Buccal cavity. So, inside the buccal cavity, there are presence of three important part that involve in digestion. Number one is tongue. Second is teeth and third is salivary gland and we have to study one by one. The first part inside the buccal cavity it is tongue part. Everybody know that the tongue is flat muscular structure that situate at the base of buccal cavity. In small classes we have studied that on the surface of the tongue specific cells are present and but you, these cells these cells are known as what? Test boards. It is very very important. What is the function of these test board? Naam se pata lag rahe. These test boards are used in the detection of test of food particle. We have take sweet food particle, sometimes chocolatey food particle. The question is that how we detect the test of food particle with the help of which structure? Tongue structure and with the help of what type of cell? test but cell. So, we have completed the first part that is situated in the buccal cavity that is tongue. So, this is the first function of tongue. The second function, tongue is also used to mix saliva. Everybody know that inside the buccal cavity, salivary gland release a specific liquid and that liquid it is known as what? Saliva and this saliva mixed in food particle. Now question is that how saliva mixed in food particle with the help of which structure? Tongue structure. So tongue having two function. One is detection of test of food particle and second mixing of saliva in our food particle. So dear students, finally just stay at home, fight with corona. We will meet tomorrow. Thank you students.